Hi, I'm John. And in this session, we're going to ease our obsessive thinking. Mind chatter, monkey mind, hamster wheel, whatever we want to call it. Obsessive thinking is incredibly exhausting and addictive at the same time. It keeps us always searching and never finding. And there's a familiar rhythm to it because we've listened to it for so long. And in that familiarity is a strange false sense of comfort. So how do we make it stop? Well, our first step is understanding that our focus isn't to make it stop at all. See, there's a message in it, hidden under the loud cacophony of voices. So instead of focusing on stopping it, we're going to take a step back and watch it from a safe distance. And from that space, see what's really true. Get into a position that you can hold for a while. Try to avoid a position you'd fall asleep in. Have an active posture so your spine is tall and your head is resting gently on your spine. Allow your eyes to gently close or if you prefer to keep them open let them gaze downward gently without focusing on anything in particular. And begin to take slower, deeper breaths than you've taken all day so far. Inhaling deep into your lower belly, feeling your diaphragm pull downward. You can even place a hand there just below your belly button to feel your lower belly press outward as you inhale. And hold it for a beat. And as you exhale, feel your lower belly contract back in. And again, inhaling slowly and deeply into your diaphragm. And this time, gently hold at the top of the breath and see if you can tap into the natural stillness that exists there. And as you exhale out slowly, when you reach the bottom of your breath, see if you can sit in the quiet, natural stillness that exists there as well. Continue breathing in this purposeful way, allowing each breath to still you even further into this moment, allowing you to settle your mind and body and arrive into this time focused on your well-being and healing. Now from this more still space, with your energy more settled, allow your breath to return back to its normal pattern and rhythm, but keep your focus on it. Use it to anchor yourself in times where you may get distracted or your mind wanders off. Now I invite you to imagine yourself on the bank of a beautiful, lush, flowing river. Hearing the sweet tones of the water gently traveling by. And the patterns and the waves of the water is rhythmic and soothing.
and with as much ease as that water flows, you can begin to notice the thoughts that you're having. As each thought passes by, imagine it floating down the river and out of sight. No attachment, just watching from a place of curiosity, knowing you are completely safe and stable on the bank of the river. No matter how large the waves may get or rushing the water becomes, you can simply and safely just watch them. Watch the thoughts and emotions float by. Noticing any judgments that come up and letting those judgments drift by down the river as well. Noticing any stories you may have been telling yourself about that thought or feeling and allow that to float by as well without attaching to it. Notice how you're feeling now. From this safe space of separation between you and your thoughts, in the present moment, you can see that the thoughts no longer serve you. They're only there to keep you looking and never finding. So you don't need to hold on to them. You can let them go. Let them drift away and instead sit in a place of openness, gratitude, self-love, and appreciation. Breathing into the space surrounding your heart and placing your attention there. See if you can begin to feel the warmth of love and acceptance that is there. Give yourself some time to get connected to it. And when you do, sit in that feeling, allowing yourself to simply be
Remember, in those times when thinking becomes overwhelming, you can always return to this still space. Give yourself the gift of remembering that those repetitive thoughts are not helping you figure anything out. After all, the level of thinking that caused the problem is never the level of thinking that reveals the solution. We can gently remind ourselves that those overwhelming voices are not real. And if we can pause and get still enough, we can hear the whispers of our hearts telling us what's really true. Allow this session to settle into your mind and heart in its natural time, even long after it's done, and foster healing and ease, inspiring you to see and hear things in ways you haven't before. Now let's take three more deep breaths together, inhaling deeply pausing at the top of the breath to notice the natural stillness that exists there, and exhaling everything out, and finding that still space again at the bottom of your breath. Again, another deep inhale and exhale, feeling that breath weave through every muscle and every cell, Last time, your deepest breath yet, sending that oxygen all the way down to the tips of your toes. And as you exhale, feel it circulating all the way back up your body. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes. Thank you for joining me. Till next time.